a massive bomb attack in a busy area of the Somali capital Mogadishu has killed at least 85 people, officials say. Dozens more were wounded when a lorry packed with explosives detonated near the entrance of a hotel. Police say two people were killed in a second bomb attack in the Medina district of the city. It is not clear who staged the attacks. Mogadishu is a regular target for the Al-Qaeda-linked Al-Shabaab group, which is battling the government. President Mohamed Abdullahi Farmajo Mohamed has declared three days of mourning for the victims of the blast. Local media reported families were gathering in the area on Sunday morning, looking for missing loved ones amidst the ruins of one of the largest bombs ever to strike the city. After the first blast, Police Captain Mohammed Hussein told Reuters news agency, it was a truck bomb. There are casualties but we do not know the exact amount as the scene is still burning. Witnesses told the BBC they believed dozens of people were dead. Huge blast erupted near Safari Hotel at Hassan Istila at Hussein M12 pic.twitter.com slash ptqqgpuo. End of Twitter post by at Farah Bashirs. The director of at Eman Ambulance Services said they had carried an unknown number of dead and injured. Number Somalia pic.twitter.com slash 1UM9BKVU0P End of Twitter post by at Hassan Istila A BBC Somali reporter at the scene said the Safari Hotel had collapsed, with people thought to be trapped under the rubble. Mogadishu resident Muhyiddin Ali told news agency AFP it was the biggest blast I have ever witnessed, it destroyed the whole area.